I'm Aaron Berlin, sitting here with Kansas third baseman Jordan Dryling. Jordan, you kind of make the transition this year. It seems like all throughout your time here at Kansas, you've bounced around from position to position, but it has to be nice going into the season knowing when you're going to start. Yeah, I mean, going into the mentality, being at third base is better than kind of just jumping around, but I mean, infield's infield, so it's kind of like if you can do one, you can do the other. Speaking of the infield this year, you have Kevin at second or Kevin at shortstop and then Alex at first, but then the second base position is kind of wide open, isn't it? Yeah, there's, I mean, there's definitely guys there that can fill the role. It's just going to come down to who can step up and perform. But I have confidence in whoever's going to be out there. As an infield this year, what are kind of some of the steps you guys have done over the offseason to kind of build morality as well as chemistry? Well, I think since, you know, having De Leon at first and Coons at short and me at third, and we've been here for four years, we all know our tendencies and how what we can do good. And I think it's helps us out, like, knowing each other's strengths and uh, just being around each other for four years, I guess. Alex kind of makes a transition of his own from the catching position to first base. Have you guys helped him out at all as far as learning how to dig the ball or throws? Or Yeah, well, coming in, he was a third baseman in high school, so he's he's always had that knack for being an infielder. He's got good hands, and he'll, he'll be fine over there at first. Well, Jordan, we appreciate you joining us here. That's Jordan Dryling, third baseman for the Kansas Jayhawks on today's position preview.